What's up guys, this is Jorge Yao back with another video and today I have an exclusive tutorial of the coveted and much anticipated Malice Death Dragon. Now you guys, you RK fans out there have been waiting for this and anticipating for this for a long time now. You guys have requested this and now I'm happy to introduce Malice. So let's take a look at Malice at a first glance. So right now I have him selected in the Dragon Roost. He's level 50. He goes up to level 60 actually. So here you are. Here are the stats on Malice. Uh, keep in mind that these stats are not his base stats obviously. He's level 50 in this uh, as you can see. So his health, his damage per second, his target damage they're obviously increased based off of his level so those are not his base damage but let's take a look at his abilities because those are cool so this is the first death dragon in the game he's a legendary ancient he's super cool and i'm so happy to show you guys and showcase him for you guys right now so let's take a look so dragon power so malice sweeps over the base to the target location dealing high damage and allowing units to life steal from these targets for 10 seconds so that's huge so not only does he do does large amounts of damage but he also allows your units to life steal from the targets that he flies over so that's huge that's that's a game changer right there and I don't think any other dragon has a cool enough or as cool ability as that so I th I'm excited to test that out let's go ahead and look at his other abilities so his first ability is chaos breath coats buildings with black flame excuse me dealing 205 to 210 damage now keep in mind that these damages are inflated because he's level 50 so that's not his base damage uh, at level 50 though it's 205 to 210 damage over five seconds while increasing incoming damage by 25 percent so that's pretty good for first spell that's actually really good so I, I'm, I'm excited to use that Curse of War. For the rest of the battle, affected troops will summon one undead warrior, level 11 in case, in this case because he's level 50, two seconds after falling in battle. Okay, so that's a cool spell. I don't know if I'm going to use that as much. Uh, I think the first spell is much cooler, um, but we'll see. Let's look at his ultimate. Uh, mas masochis masochism. Sorry, sorry for the pronunciation. Affected troops are cleansed of all common debuffs and then for the next 6.77 seconds Again, it's 6.77 seconds because he's level 50, or sh I should say she, because Malice is female. Um, 6.77 seconds incoming damage will heal instead of harm. Wow, that's actually really powerful. So I think in terms of the gameplay, I think I'm going to use hit her, excuse me again. Uh, I'm going to use a lot of the Chaos Breath and probably a lot of the mas Masochism. Man, I can't really pronounce that word, but Masochism and... Chaos Breath, they look like the cool ones to use. So I have a level 50 right now just to showcase for you guys. Now this Ancient, you can actually win in an upcoming tournament uh, called the Malice Event. I don't think that's the actual name of the event, but let's just call it the Malice Event for the sake of uh, simplicity. So the Malice Event, what's happening is you'll have a Totalizer in your kingdom. Um, so in the Totalizer, uh, you basically earn these things called Souls. So you gather souls and you win souls from normal PvP battles uh, and other battles too. So you know, so it's similar to like the, the Bane Maw Frost Fangs and Acorns from Yagamo, where you're, in, you're where you're earning this currency. So as you can see at the top, you can see this soul soul uh, icon right there. It's pretty cool. It's that purpley thing right there. So you earn souls, and then you have basically a totalizer in your kingdom. So um, at the top prize, though, is where you get to actually win Malice. So you definitely want to participate in that and actually win Malice. So everyone has a chance to win Malice. But there's a kicker, too. On top of that, there will be an, also a leaderboard coinciding with the, uh, the totalizer. So there's, let's go ahead and actually see Malice in action. So let's go ahead and do a battle. So one Battlestone, let's go ahead, I'm against West Fred 90, so I can have the potential of earning three souls as you can see at the bottom. Easy base, easy base, so I want to change my Ancient to Malice so I can use his ability. So for the sake of showing off his abilities, I'm not going to go for the Stronghold right now because that's too easy. Let's go ahead and actually uh, test them out a little bit. So let's drop some troops. And I want to see this action, this in action. Chaos Breath coats buildings with black flame, dealing 205 or 210 damage over five seconds. Let's go ahead and coat these buildings with that. Wow! So 
Look at that effect. Wow, look at how quick they die. They die so quickly. And let's actually drop Malice. Okay, so Malice is doing, he's flying around, he's doing damage. But let's let's actually uh, use him in action. So he flies over. Look at those effects, that's so cool. Wow, okay. So I have to wait another 19 seconds. We'll do another battle, but dang, that's awesome. So I'm using this uh, Chaos Breath over and over again, but I kind of want to test out this... Uh, Masochism. Effective troops are cleansed of all common debuffs and then for the next 6.77 seconds incoming damage will heal instead of harm. So that is huge because basically you're not taking any damage and you're healing and plus on top of that with Malice flying over your troops are healing and do, uh, dealing extra damage. So this dragon is super OP. Look at that. That dragon just took out that storage by itself. That's insane. Insane. So let's go ahead and do another battle. Let's see if we can find a harder battle and really, really test out Malice because Malice is just so cool. So I'm earning all these uh, souls along the way, which contributes to the totalizer, which contrib contributes to me gaining Malice, even though I already have Malice. Um, but also it contributes to the global leaderboard. So you definitely want to check that out. You want to win Malice through the totalizer, and then you want to keep competing and uh, go for the global leaderboards because the prizes on the global leaderboards are the statues. Now the statues are permanent, as you guys already know, and there's different tiers like the gold, um, silver, and bronze, and uh, depending on how many you collect, you can upgrade to obsidian at some point. So that's pretty cool. So let's go ahead. This base is still not that great of a base. But let's just drop, how about, let's just drop one troop, so just the Paladins. And then I'm just gonna use this um, first ability again, Chaos Breath. And look at how much damage it's taking just from the Paladins. The Paladins aren't even getting hurt right now, which is insane. Like, that's, that's crazy. So I haven't even dropped Malice yet. So I'm dropping Malice right now on an Archer Tire. Look how much damage he's doing. Malice is just taking, I could probably take out this entire base with just Malice to be honest. Look how much damage. Look how much damage. I haven't even swooped yet. So I'm going to swoop right now. Uh, basically, so with the swoop, the uh, the buildings take extra damage and grant life steal. So that's pretty, pretty strong. So you guys definitely want him. You definitely want him. So I'm going to drop Masochism on that one Paladin. Look at that Paladin heal up. It doesn't last too long, but look. Look at that health. She keeps healing up and keeps dealing damage to that one watchtower. That is insane. That is insane. And you can watch Malice just rip apart the stronghold. So I'm really excited for this dragon. You guys have been waiting for it for a long time. He's definitely the strongest dragon in the game. In terms of Ancients, it definitely adds another layer of strategy in terms of how you want to play. And man, the lifesteal is just incredible. So let me drop his second ability. Uh, just to show you guys. Wow, that, that, that effect is actually really cool. Wow, that's actually really cool. So let's go ahead. So we won that battle. Let's do one more battle just to showcase it and then I'll recap the actual event and then uh, and that'll be it. But I'm really excited to just play with Malice. Malice is awesome. Hopefully this is a, a stronger base. It's win streak 9, so hopefully a little bit stronger. So let's go ahead. So I'm going to drop uh, a group of soldiers. And I'm going to use Chaos Breath on these buildings right here. And look at that. They're just dying. They're melting. My soldiers are literally just melting these bases right now. And I literally can just spam this spell because it's a level 1 spell. And they're just melting, melting those uh, defenses right now. And I haven't even dropped Malice. So I'm going to drop Malice right now. Malice is doing work. Um, so I've only dropped one set of troops and they've already taken what, two, four, six buildings down already by themselves. So I'm using Malice right now, I'm going to use the swoop, and then I'm going to drop some other soldiers down here. Just so you can see, wow look how much damage these are taking, like just from one swoop all those buildings have taken that almost 50% health taken away. Now of course these are lower level buildings um, and this is a level 50 malice but wow like this is incredible. And I'm going to use masochism to basically heal up my troops and do damage again which is insane. Do another swoop. Wow, this is insane. So I'm going to use Chaos Breath again on the Stronghold and some other buildings and basically watch them melt away. See, I haven't even dropped my Soldier or my two Paladins because I don't even need them. Now again, this is an easy base, but imagine what this, uh, what this combination could do to like a Stronghold 10, 11, 12, 13. And Malice can go up to level 60, so this is, all, this is not even a maxed out Malice. So this is pretty cool, pretty cool. 
So again, so that's Malice uh, in action. Much anticipated. You guys wanted Malice, and here she is, showcasing it right now. Let's see what I get in the relic chest. Okay, Mana Vial. So let's go home and let's do a little recap. So, there is an event called the Malice event coming up. I'm not sure exactly what the event name is, but it's basically centered around Malice. So you have a totalizer in your kingdom, uh, which you compete for souls. So you do normal battles to get, gain souls, um, and as you gain more souls, you hit different tiers. And each tier, you basically gain rewards. And at the top of the totalizer, you win Malice, so that's the real key. You really want to win Malice as fast as possible because once you have Malice, then the real competition begins because then you're pit against all the other kingdoms in Astara and you're really seeing who, who can collect the most souls. And Malice gives you a big boost in terms of how many souls you get per battle. And he's just, and she's, excuse me, I, see, I keep saying he, but Malice, she is just so strong. She's just so strong. So um, definitely, definitely want to play this event. And I'm definitely excited to play this event and uh, win Malice in the real game. Again, some of these numbers are not correct because this is on a development build. But I guess I wanted to showcase basically Malice in effect, uh, the event that's coming up, and how it works, and how you can win it. And yeah, I'm just really excited for this event. Um, but that does it for this video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Uh, and you know, I hope you guys are really excited about this Malice event and winning Malice for yourself. Um, so this is Jorge Yao, and thanks again for watching this video. Uh, if you liked it, don't forget to comment, like, and subscribe. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Jorge Yao, peace out.